I used to be a big guy. But I lost it. And not only that, I got fit. Now I want to tell my journey and give tips on workouts for all different fitness levels. Advice on eating. And just showing real life situations. If you either want to lose weight, get stronger, live a healthier lifestyle, or even just get better, I challenge you and the buddy to join me. I call this the Get Better Together Challenge. Seven tips on how you can drop two to three pounds in one week. But you ain't gonna sue me now. You're not gonna sue me. These are just my thoughts, so you better speak to Dr. first. Number seven, count calories. Now, there are 3,500 calories and one pound of fat. When I first started out, I consumed 1,000 calories a day. Now, if you wanna do that, that's your choice, but ultimately you would like to speak to a doctor first. Livestrong.com says that men should consume at the very bare minimum 1,500 calories a day and women should consume 1,200 calories a day. Everyone is different. Number six, count your sugar and sodium intake. In one of my previous videos, I say, American Heart Association says that the average American consumes 92.4 grams of sugar in a day and 3,436 milligrams of sodium. Woo! Now that's a lot when they say that the average man is supposed to consume 37.5 grams of sugar and the average woman should consume only 25 grams of sugar. Too much sugar is one of the main reasons of obesity in America and it causes way too many health issues. Now one teaspoon equals four grams of sugar. Dang on it, that is a lot! Woo! Number five, drink nothing but water. In one of the previous videos, I mentioned you can also have up to 24 ounces of coffee a day and you can only add up to two teaspoons of creamer. No extra additional sugar. Number four, cut out the grains and cut out the starches. Now some grains and starches consist of beans, peas, breads, rice, potatoes, flour, pasta, corn. If you need to gain some more knowledge, Go on the internet and look up starches. Number three, no butter, no oils. When I first started out with my diet, I cut out the butter and I cut out the oils and then my fat started to just sweat right off of my back. I saw the bacon, I saw the, if you wanna use olive oil cooking spray, just only use a tab little bit so that your food won't stick to the pan or the pot. But don't use any of the other stuff. Number two, beginners. Do my home workouts. I want you to do my home workouts three times a week, and I would like you to do the ab workouts two times a week. For my advanced level people, I would like you to do the workouts as hard as you can, and just fight and fight and fight through it. And number one, educate yourself. If you don't know what you're putting in your body, open your phone, type it in Google, Yahoo, whatever. Ask Jeeves, hey, what is this? How many grams of sugar is in this pear? How many grams of sugar is inside of this inside of this uh, uh, apple? How much how much sodium is is inside of of this um piece of chicken that I'm about to eat? The more you know, the more you have knowledge, some knowledge about what's going on in your body, the more you'll be able to drop these pounds quickly. Now, I took a picture of myself every Monday. I also weighed myself every Monday too. What I want you to do is, I want you to watch your body transform every week. But you just have to stay committed and you have to stay dedicated. If you have any questions, comment. Tell me your thoughts. Let me know what you think. But remember, everyone's diet is different. I'm only giving you suggestions based off of what I've gone through. All right? So let's get better and let's continue to grow and live a healthier lifestyle. God bless. Please watch some of our previous videos. Also like, share, and subscribe.